We've got a ton of work to do here today before we leave for Illinois and Michigan tomorrow. We gotta get these cars fixed, we gotta get packed. Um, we just gotta get everything ready. So uh, we better get cracking, let's go get it. guys care if I took pictures of you like not of you but of my building and you just happen to be standing here right now oh, yeah. does that matter nope. okay cool thanks <laughs> highway on this one 6570 you get this real bad wind noise from this uh, right rear door you can see it's a little bit wedged open there so we're gonna massage a little bit and see if we can make that go away it's really not that big of a deal but when you're going really long distances and that's all you can hear it becomes very very annoying Just need to make it clear that I am definitely no collision repair specialist. I just have some friends that I've seen beat on cars like that before, and it works. And this is my own stuff, so I really don't care. And that looks pretty dang good. Look at that. Shout out to my guy Harkin, Minty. All right, so what do we all got? Air filter, cabin filter, oil change, uh, rear brake pads, rotors, and an alignment. Should be good to go for this next trip we got going on here. Uh, that other car we had in here, that one's done, gone, easy peasy, but holy cow, this took way longer than it needs to be. Actera Group was here today. We had to work on the tanks outside, so that took up some time. And I also had to show some cars, but we also fixed that air leak on that right rear door, so that would be six things, actually. So we're good to go. So I think that's about gonna wrap us up for today here. I'm starving, and like I said, that took a little bit longer than I wanted to. I wanna go see my kitties and get some food and get packing. So we might come back early tomorrow morning, knock out a couple more things, talk to a couple customers, but uh, 
yeah, good stuff. Let's keep rolling. We've been rushing here the last day like crazy to get everything done, but uh, we do everything done. We're all packed. We got our makeshift stuff for our bed back there. We got all the bowling balls. All stuff we need if we break down, which isn't gonna happen. Um, so yeah, we got about a seven hour drive here. But uh, if I can get this in focus. And, uh, there we go. Still learn how to use this camera. Six and a half hours, so uh, let's hit the road. Good to go, and I am all packed up, and I'm really excited. So we're about hmm, three hours from Jackson. We ran into this traffic jam here, so I thought I'd pull the camera out for a minute. Um, last night, after I went home, I tried to tried to sleep, but I couldn't sleep, so I actually went back up to the shop and I I recharged the AC in this car because last week in St. Louis it was about 90 degrees, and today it's 97 degrees here and. I promise you, if I wouldn't have charged my AC, I would have no AC today. And I do not roll without heat or AC. Oven, and I sure as shit don't fucking roll! I've got uh, 18 minutes left before we have arrived at our first stop of the weekend, which is uh, Jack's 68, Jackson, Michigan. We're bowling the Midwest Scratch Bowling Series.
Today turned out to be an amazing day. We got the Jack 60 around uh, six o'clock, and uh, I didn't really want to record qualifying or anything like that. I just wanted to get in the zone, bowl well, stay cool, and uh, yeah, just make it through uh, qualifying. So we end up making it through qualifying, qualify fifth uh, to get us to match play, and then a match play went 202, which was open ninth and tenth. That was cool, and then uh, 221 in the semifinal, and then the final match, the finals uh, went 226 against Chandler Stevens. In the 10th frame, Chandler ended up striking out, which forced me to mark and get good talents in the 10th. And in the 10th, I went up there and just kind of missed it at the bottom. Rang a 10, <laughs> naturally. Uh, I was, I was blessed enough to convert that and then get the good count to get the win. So that was awesome. I'm super grateful for that. I have a huge cramp in my foot right now. Not all days are that good. These last two days were, were awesome. So just be grateful for what we got. Pray we get uh, for these next two days. A few days are just as good. And <laughs> let's top it all off. Fast and the Furious Tokyo Drift is on. I mean, you can't ask for a much better day than that, can you? Oh, we want to race the new GK! 